Hey everyone. Uh, if you recall, our Ranger had been sitting outside for almost 20 years before we bought it. And last weekend we took it on its first road trip after getting things up and going. And unfortunately we got caught in a torrential downpour. One thing we found is that all of the grime and grit that had landed on the windshield in those 20 years it had been sitting, uh, just made for a pretty dangerous situation because the wipers were catching on the windshield, weren't doing a good job of clearing the water. Um, it almost feels like a light grit sandpaper. So today, we're going to see if we can repair this windshield so that we have great wiper operation. Unfortunately, it may be a little hard to see on camera, but as I rub my hand across this windshield, I can feel my fingers just catching on a lot of different spots that have built up on this over the years. Uh, so today, we're going to do a deep clean of the windshield and use some polish and see if we can get this nice and smooth. And to begin, I've parked the truck in the shade so that things that I put on the windshield, my compounds, my cleaners don't evaporate too quickly. And I've gone ahead and removed the windshield wiper arms. Um, if you're interested in how these come off, it's super easy. I'll put a link to a video that walks you through it. Okay, I'm going to start by cleaning this windshield with just some of this invisible glass, glass cleaner. I just picked this up at my local Walmart down the street and just some standard blue shop towels. Okay, I've now wiped down the windshield with invisible glass that's gotten off all the bugs and the bigger debris. The next step is I'm going to use a glass cleaning clay and I'm going to pair that with just a bottle of water as a lubricant and I'm just going to spray and wipe. It's very similar to claying a car. I'm going to just open my clay here. And this will get some of the deeper seated things out of the windshield. So I'm gonna just tear my clay in half and just get a little block of clay. And I'm just gonna start at the top, just spray on some water, a little quadrant, and just start rubbing the clay to get off what I can. Now that the windshield has been clayed, I'm going to take one of my microfiber cloths and just wipe the windshield down because the next step is going to be a polishing compound that has a very light cut, but I don't want any debris that may be remaining to get in with that and potentially introduce scratches. All right, now that the windshield has been cleaned with glass cleaner, we've gone over it with clay, our last step is we're going to use a fine glass polish with a DA polisher. So I have a glass polish pad on here. It's the one that was recommended with this polish. Uh, this is a very light compound. It's not super strong. I'm gonna just put a couple little drops. I, got, I have just a few drops on my pad and I'm going to be operating on speed one or two. I'm not going to go too fast. I don't want to burn the windshield at all. I'm going to start by just smearing a little bit of the polish on the window and I'm done with the polisher, so I'm going to take a microfiber cloth and wipe off the excess polish compound. All 
Now the wiper arms are back on, the windshield feels super smooth. I'm gonna hop in and I'm gonna try the windshield washer, see if it catch my blades catch anymore. And that's it. The wiper blades are no longer catching on the windshield and I am confident that the next time I'm caught in a downpour driving my Ford Ranger, I'm gonna be able to safely navigate the roadways. Until next time, I'm Ben with Grab's Garage. If you like this video, please make sure you like, comment, and subscribe as we are continuously pushing out new content.